Hi everyone, we are going to take you through the drills that we used in class this week for your legs and your back. So we're starting on that seal stretch for eight counts, making sure that your shoulders are away from your ears and you're pressing down. So we're holding it eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And then we're going to bring it down slowly for four. Our hands go behind our head. We're looking down at the mat and we're bringing our bodies up for four. One, two, three, four. Four, good, we're resetting that seal stretch. We're up for eight. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring it down, two, three, and we're bringing it in. One, two, three, and four. Then we're just going to bring your body round into your straight shape. Now, we can do your basic bridge entry where you're just taking it from straight shape. Bring your hands in towards your ears, feet into your bottom, and then we're pushing up to that bridge and holding that stretch, pushing your shoulders towards the opposite wall. If you can, get your feet together, straighten your legs and really push that bridge. Or you can take it from the sitting position where we're bringing our legs out in second. We're bending our legs, our fingertips are facing the opposite way and then as we push into our bridge we rotate our hand round to touch our, to our face our toes and we're holding this again bring our legs together make this nice bridge shape okay we're going to take one hand off we're going to hold it for 10 counts 10 just put it on your tummy nine eight seven six five four three two one swap it over good excellent and then bring it down Right, we're just going to talk about your position. So if Lucy comes flat, we're going to then bring your body in a, a straight shape. And we're going to bring your body, your leg into a retiri. Right? And then we're going to definitely play the leg. So we're just slowly straighten the leg. And we hold it up here for four count counts. And then we're going to just pulse it for four. One, two, three, four. Okay? Now, you can practice that shape on the floor. And then we can practice it in our bridge shape. So we're going to push up into bridge. Good, I'm really pushing these shoulders, keeping the elbows nice and straight. And we're bringing that rotiri into your foot. We're stretching that leg nice and high and we're pulsing it one, two, three, four. Good job and bring it down. And you can do that on your right and your left leg. Remember, you can also do it against the wall, which we practice and you're trying to get your shoulders and your chest right against the wall and then kicking so that your toe just taps off the wall. All right, and then from there, we're just gonna go into your deep lunges. So, legs parallel, we're going to bring our hands to second, we're making sure that you're right in the high heels of your foot, so that tondo at the back is nice and high, and we're going to do three lunges to the floor, making sure our knee touches the floor, right, nice and slow and controlled, so we go one, two, three, four, then we're going to lift that leg to the best, notice how your shoulders stay in line with your hips, we pulse that leg, one, two, three, four. Four, back to your lunge. One, two, three, four, pulse it. One, two, three, last time. Down, two, three, leg off, pulse it. One, two, three, four. We're going to walk our hands down into that needle. Good, we're trying to walk our hands as close to our leg as we can get it. And then we're just going to kick that leg up and down for eight. Eight. Keep the hips nice and square. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Slide it back into your split. Nice, slow and controlled. Hold that. Make sure your hips are square. Your knees are turned under. If this is nice and easy, stretch up. And just fall over. And hold that stretch. And repeat it all on your left side as well.